time for Mario Wonder. It's going to be really cool. Good morning, everyone. Well, good afternoon. It's time. For Wowie Zowie. It's really exciting that we finally get a 2D Mario game I've been, like, interested in. And not a new Mario brother. Well, a new Mario Brother would be great. I would love love a new Mario Brother, like some bre pretzel or bretzel or something. That would be great. But no, we, we get a brand new Mario game. So everyone, welcome to the stream. Shall we begin? This is kind of my thing. I don't know if you knew that. But I'm kind of the Mario guy. I'm one of the Mario guys. There's plenty of Mario guys. But I do love a good Mario. Am I... Am I extra loud, chat? Is something really weird with my audio? I, f I, I see the red. It seems like it's peaking. It's about the same, right? Okay, maybe it always peaks like this. That's weird. Uh, you know what? Hang on. Wow, he's How about now? Is that all right? It should be fine. Okay. The day is upon us, everybody. It's Super Mario Brothers Wonder, or as I lovingly call it, Mario Wonder, because it's just easier. And uh, this is the first 2D Mario game since probably Mario Maker 2 that I've been really excited for. Oh, it's also the only 2D Mario game since Mario Maker 2. But there's been a lot of interesting things said about this game, and it looks great, and I feel like this could be the best 2D Mario since Mario World. And that is cool. So it's time to wowie our zowies. And I'm gonna play. I only wish the Yoshis weren't, like, Babby mode, but I, I kinda... I think it's cool that they're available to play. But, yeah, we have a full roster of, of similar characters. <laughs> it's -a me! New Mario voice. It's a, it's a bittersweet moment to hear a new Mario, but, you know... Dude's doing a good job. I heard some of the voice lines. Welcome to the Flower Kingdom. It's just a short hop away from the Mushroom Kingdom. Upon receiving an invitation from Prince Florian, Mario and the others are traveling here for the first time. Someone said, New Mario sounds kind of weird. Well, it's a new Mario. Where's the party? I'm going to kill these flowers. I hate them. No, I'm kidding. They're fine. These are like like flower toads. So many visitors today. Oh man, the animation's already, and it's so bright and colorful. Nabbit, what are you doing? How did Nabbit even like? Nabbit is like a forced character. Nabbit forced his way into the Mario world, and now he's here to stay. I didn't ever say to myself, "Boy, I want more Nabbit," and this guy's just in here. Nabbit is the best, how dare you? Well, Nabbit is invincible. Change the flower voices to Italian? Oh, I will, don't worry. Just for a little bit. Someone said, I forgot Vinnie Vinesauce decided what characters are in Mario. I've invented Mario characters better than Nabbit. As an Italian, as an Italian New York City folk, I get to decide, yes. Anyway, it's Bowser again, but this time he becomes a castle. It's fine. That's all I need. I like the, the visual uh, of the smog. But how does he get off on doing this? Not that, like, get off. I mean, how does he do this? Yes. Oh, 
Oh, man. Oh, you fucked up. Is that King Bowser? How could he steal our Wonder Flower in our Flower Castle, too? Oh, that's how he did it, right? He stole the, the Wonder Flower. Um, it's weird that flowers are the things creating the drug, when mushrooms have historically been associated more with that. I can't believe he merged with our beautiful castle like that. It's just so awful. Bowser will make a terrible mess of our whole kingdom if we don't stop him somehow. Oh yeah, peyote. <laughs> Poppy seeds, yeah. That's why they say don't eat bagels before a drug test. You'll help us? Thank you. I'd like to be your guide if you don't mind. Let me just... But yeah, I do really like the psychedelic aspect of this game. And, uh... It's got its, it's got a style. I'm sure there's a lot of surprises, but just from the videos I've seen... Okay, the flowers is still weird. Like, you can turn that off, but it's, it's so strange. Well, here we go, everybody. It's really, it's amazing. It's a new Mario. Well, oh, what's going on here? Chat, what's going on here? Oh, we're good, sorry. So anyway, as I was saying, boy, this game is very, very psychedelic. I don't know why Mario looks like that, but... Good. <laughs> Good! Oh, there it is. Yeah, where there we go. We got a, a nice wowie zowie today. Oh, that wowie zowie is sticking straight up. Wait, if I put the full weight of my zowie on that goomba, will it crush? Good. Again, game is very psychedelic, as you can see, just purely by the fat pipes and, and the thick elephant trunk. Yeah, those are some fat pipes, let me tell you. What's wrong with your copy? Um, I think they just did a lot of really interesting, weird things with the character models, I'm pretty sure. Either that or the cartridge is slightly tilted. Wow, cool pipe. <laughs> wow. It really is like Alice in Wonderland. I love those wormy pipes. Who up slinking their worm right now in Mario Galaxy Wonder? Or whatever this is. There he is, wow. Well, not only did they change the voice actor, but they changed the model, too. It's a lot of style. It's a lot of style. Piranha plants on parade. Did you download the Day Zero patch yet? Oh, that might be why this is so cool.
Chat, you do realize I'm gonna have to do that previous level over again, right? So, hang on. Hang on. I want to try a different character. Yep. Characters. Uh, who do you want to see, chat? Who do you want to see? Well, let's try. Let's try Yoshi. Well, Daisy and Patch we can also try, but I want to see each character before we um, before we take the flower <laughs> away. <laughs> It took them 25 years, but they finally changed the Yoshi model. <laughs> Look at him, he's just li linky splinking all the way through this level. He looks sad. Well, you'd be sad too if you were the invincible, like, babby character of the game. No one's gonna feel good about beating a level with Yoshi. Touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Oh my god. Hang on. I don't want to spoil that just yet. We'll get to that in a bit. We'll get to that in a bit. I know we're, we're, we're edging a little bit, but I want to see a couple more characters. And then I'll try to untilt the cartridge. Do, do you understand? You understand. You want to see Nabbit? Okay. Okay, Luigi look uh, look pretty good right now. Um, let me see if I can turn the talking flowers uh, language German. Und los geht's. Ah. Hey. Wait, you can bump into Goombas now? Oh, unless they bite you. I saw that. I saw that they can bite you. Schuss ist gut da! I'm sorry, Luigi. I want to see Peach Wowie Zowie. Vinny, fix game, please. If you pray really hard to your Lord and Savior, um, Jesus Christ, then maybe. But I don't know how to fix the game because it's it's. I'm sorry, everybody. It's just it's a bit. I mean, it's cartridge tilting. It's 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 a day, day zero patch. I mean, it's normal. I mean, it's psychedelic. I mean, my people. Bafangul! Oh, oh, they got a really good Italian voice. Look at that. Oh, the <laughs> oh, we've wow, we zowied a little too far. Uh. I like, look at the Goomba face. Look at the Goomba face. Oh man. I was enjoying that Wowie Zowie. I wonder if Daisy gets the same Zowie treatment. Hang on. And that is Super Mario Wonder, everybody. Sin creation is what I like to call this. Alright, Daisy, come on. Your your Zowie's gonna be normal, isn't it? Okay. Yeah. 
Luigi, I don't know what was in those brownies, but it's getting real weird. Oh god, it's the same thing. That's a gif right there. Yeah, I mean, the thumbnail has just... <laughs> thumbnail discovered. Well, part of it, maybe. You gotta have Mario in the thumbnail, too. This is the Wowie Zowie. You know, like, the Yoinky Sploinky is a dance? This is the Wowie Zowie. The way Daisy walks. Just the regular walk cycle. In her legs, I I know. Chat one more. Uh, two characters left. Two characters left. Nabbit. And then Toad. Every Toad is same Toad, I would imagine. I don't think the Toads are going to look different. At least they modeled her granny panties. Never say that again. Thank you. Italian, Dutch, Portuguese, Russian, Japanese. Let's try Japanese. <laughs> oh, Nabbit can't become elephant. Nabbit, you're so fucking lame. Go back to Link Between Worlds. Okay, one more character, Blowed. I like to ascribe my own personality traits to Blowed. Jump noise is pretty good. As little toad. As little bloat, sorry, little bloat. Spots. A great voice. That's a pretty good wowie zowie too, but it's still trunk just sticking straight up. Oh, we we got vibrating elephant toad. No, it's fine, Chad. It's normal. This is all normal stuff. Again, corrupt uh, cartridge tilt um, uh, a bit slash um, psychedelic game, etc., etc., etc. It was all just a dream. Luigi, none of that happened! Oh, Mario, I saw it! I saw it! Toad became an elephant! <sighs> Luigi, no one can become an elephant! No, Mario, I swear! I saw her granny panties! And Blood was there! And some weird purple rabbit! Onward and upward! Luigi, there's no such thing as the Flower Kingdom. 
There's no such thing as elephant mushrooms. This was all in your head, Luigi. Oh, Mario, the flowers, they talk! And the elephant trunks were sticking straight up! Luigi, how many times do I gotta tell you, there's no such thing as- Oh, oh, oh my god, I'm an elephant! Oh, Luigi, help! It hurts! It hurts! Mario, you, you're looking kind of thick, you know? <laughs> anyway, welcome to Mario Wonder, everybody. This is the famed elephant. <laughs> There's no timer on the levels. And it's a good thing there isn't, because this is so far a 15-minute level. <laughs> But, uh, yeah. Yeah, it certainly is uh, a nice-looking video game. And there's a lot of, um, detail. Apparently, they put extra detail into the animations because of the movie. And they were like, people are going to expect a level of quality. So it only took a movie to make a billion dollars for them to actually, like, put some style into their 2D Mario games. And I don't hate the new Super Mario Brothers games. I don't think... The first one's good, and, you know, they're good games, but they're just kind of boring. They're not really very memorable. There's a couple moments that are neat, but um, this is already... On level one, there's already more style in this than there ever was in a new Super Mario Brothers. Aside from that Van Gogh level. Someone just said wrong opinion. Mods. Convince this guy in a kind way that they are wrong. Thank you. I wonder if they enjoy that. So yeah, New Super Mario Brothers is, is fine. It's, it's a game, I played all of them. I never finished number two, the one with all the gold coins. But, um, they're fine. They're, they're totally just fine games. They're fun to play. Um, the 3D Mario games have, I've loved better since, like, Mario World and Yoshi's Island. I feel like the 3D Mario games were the main focus. And I love those. But I, uh... I like that they took their time with this game. I like that they gave the reins over to some new staff members. So that way they could come up with some interesting ideas. I also, I like how the animations are a little, like... Like, you can see, there's, there's a little, um... What's the word I'm looking for? Exaggerated, but also the frame rate. Sometimes they lower them a little bit and, like, have Mario kind of just, like, snap to a, uh... More expressive. Yeah. It's, it's really nice. It's, I've seen in the previews and just playing it now, I'm really... I'm really just enjoying the way Mario moves around and jumps. This is the, um, important mechanic that every 2D platformer in 3D needs. A 2D side-scrolling platformer. You have to go into the background. Donkey Kong does it, Koibi does it, gotta do it. Virtual Boy Wario did it. So you can get over there. Don't make me turn you off, flowers. It knows what it is. Pretty good spin jump. What's this? What was this function? You can put an emote down, I guess, for multiplayer. Balloon? Yeah. <laughs> 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 
This is really cool. They're drugged out of their goddamn minds. When he says wonderful, that's that's the, like the the very clear indication that it's a different Mario. But but the new um the new voice actor is is doing a pretty good job so far. Got the hoo hoos just right. I mean those are perfect hoo hoos. The new Bing Bing Wahoo Man sounds like the old Bing Bing Wahoo Man in some ways, and I know it's going to take some time for people to adjust, myself included. But, you know, I wish him the new guy luck. Big overalls to fill, that's right, yeah. Cool level. I don't really know why they're singing, but, you know... Of all the times I've made Mario Luigi drug jokes... Luigi, this is drugs! I mean, it's just, you know, it's a staple. Uh, and it's, it's, it's a low-hanging fruit. Never has it been more correct. That level has a secret exit? Really? You won't find it? One day I will. I like the uh, crouch fireball animation. I also, I, I really enjoy that they're hiding under their hats. Oh my god. Different instruments per power-up. So Elephant has like the brass. Um, the fucking acapella is, I guess, the flower. Luigi sounds bad. You think so? I don't. Yeah, I saw a couple people saying that. I don't think Luigi sounds bad. That sounded like Luigi to me. But that's gonna happen. I mean, it's gonna take some people... It's gonna take a couple years to get adjusted. And trust me when I say I did a whole video about how much Charles is, like, just one of my... Not... I wouldn't say idols in terms of voice acting, but he's, he's, he's great. He's just a really great guy. He's very talented. I met him a couple times now, and he's really nice. And uh, it's gonna be hard to, to not have him be the, the main voice. But, you know... Unless they use canned lines of his forever. He's not that young anymore, you know? Is the FPS really this bad? What's bad about it? I think that's a troll post. That might just be a troll post. It's not 300 so bad. Uh, it, for a game like this, I don't need 60 FPS necessarily. I mean, I didn't even think about the FPS until someone just said it just now. But part of it, I think, is also the style. Like, that coin rotating was low FPS on purpose. 
But uh, no, it's it's pretty solid 30 so far. Oh, this is cool. And trust me, I can be a frame rate whore. It's just for a Mario game, I don't think I care all that much. Get back here. Vincent, this is 60. Is it confirmed 60? Wow, look at me then. So, that guy was insane then. I mean, I am too, clearly, but that guy in particular was insane, the chat member. Got it, okay. Name one chat member that isn't insane, you can't. Um... It's solid 60, aside from a few exceptions. That, yeah, I don't really know why I thought it was 30 then, but it looks it looks smooth to me. It looks good. Gameplay is good. Um, but yeah, there is a style on some of the characters and some of the items that lowers the frame rates. Uh, I guess that maybe is what the chat member was saying. Either that or they were just, you know... I don't know if you know this, but Nintendo... Sometimes people don't like Nintendo. So that can sometimes happen. Yeah. It's true. Isn't this fun? The flower castle is me, and I'm the flower castle. So much wonder power. I can feel myself getting stronger and stronger and stronger! Soon everything will be more! <laughs> <laughs> that no good Bowser, I won't stand for his antics. We've got to get him somehow. We'll get to him. Let's use that propeller flower up ahead to catch up. I got a little Mario Wonder poster for this. I saw Fyrus got a like a press kit, including like a little like 3D flower, like a little uh, uh, toy flower. How the hell do you get a press kit from Nintendo? My dad's got the castle now. Nobody's going to be able to stop him now that he's all powerful. Wait, he just put his stinky gas on every level? This is getting worse and worse, and look at the plants coiled around that house over there. Let's try using our wonder seeds. I bet that'll fix this. Vinny, how do you get press kit, period? Serious question. Um... You know what? I still don't really even know. I'll tell you in a minute how it's worked out for me over the years. Um, is everything alright in here? I'm so scared, I thought I'd wilt on the spot, but I'm glad I was here to keep this badge safe. Oh yeah, badges. They have lots of different effects. People who travel through the Flower Kingdom like using them. Prince Florian, if I could be so bold, would you accept this gift from me? I'm sure someone as princely as you will know how to use it best. Of course they're just toads, but flowers. <laughs> Thank you, I've always wanted to wear one of these. I can use the power of this badge to help everyone.
They take some trouble out of your journeys. Can you use a badge to make your journeys more troublesome? Well, in the air, press R or shake control to open your hat and float down. Oh, there are badges that make the game harder. It's these blocks from Mario 3. That hat has to be huge to slow Elephant Luigi. We're gonna need more Wonder Seeds for that. If you want to look at the map, press L. Oh, you actually get, like, full freedom in some of these areas. Journey together. Oh, that's like an online beacon. Here at the Poplin shop, we sell everything. We accept flower coins as payment. Wonder seed coin reward. Oh, oh, boost badge. Earn coins for defeating enemies. Oh, it's a it's a gotcha. Swimming, Luigi. See, this one I like, because it's just extra coins. Break time, hurry, hurry. I also recommend turning online just to check it out. It's interesting. Okay. Do I just do that here, or...? I guess so. You can have fun with folks from anywhere. Uh, I don't want to do an actual... ...like... ...thing where other people are in the game. Of course, I pressed the wrong goddamn button. This is suspicious, chat. <clears throat> this spot right here. I don't like that spot. Who are these people? Here we go. Ghosts! Yeah, you could just see ghosts, I guess. <clears throat> Interesting. They died badly? Oh, that's a shame. Yoinky Spoinky! Bulma? Very cool, that. No, 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 don't knock each other out, go this way. Wait, I'm seeing other characters. Are those real people or ghosts? 
I mean, I'll find out in a second, I suppose. It's both? I like you can you can see where your fireballs hit the um those little fellers. It, it just leaves a red mark on them. extra time. Oh, this is insanity. <laughs> Holy shit. What? You can't do that. Hot troops, yeah. Yoshi was KO'd. It's almost like Mario 35. Big! I missed one. Somewhere. can't get all three at once. It's the exit that gets knocked. Oh, that's cool. Okay. The long enemy is called a Kumba. <laughs> Fuck off. You're lying. I wonder if any of these people are watching the stream right now. If you are a ghost watching the stream... Join me here and jump three times. All right, never mind. This is an F099. One of my favorite things about Mario World and Mario 3 is just the amount of secrets. Just everywhere. I'm like, how much... How many times I replayed those games and found something new? Why are they so long? Uh, to answer the question about how I guess get press kits, or have historically gotten some, uh, they've just reached out to me. Partially because I am on some kind of press list because of, um, me signing up for PAX East. And, um, that has still, I think... People still think I'm press. So I'm pretty sure that's one way. The other way is my YouTube um, network people sometimes get opportunities that they, they email me about. They're like, do you have anyone that would fit for this game? We want to send a press kit. So that's another way. Um, and then the final way is some people just found me on YouTube and said, oh, they played this game before. Ours is like that. We want to send them our game. So those those are the three ways.
Let's go to where the coiled plant is. I want to wow he's out with Peach. Huh? No, I just want to play as Peach. <laughs> you said it, Flower. These, these, like, round hippos fill these holes. But only if you wowie-zowie them. Yeah. Oh, you can jump on them, never mind. I, I like these flowers before they're watered. Do you think anyone ever... Whoa! Vinny, please, my dog watches the stream. Sorry, dog. <clears throat> You've heard of the Venus flytrap, yeah? seem to have missed a thing. Vinny, the bubble. No, that was numbers. There were numbers on the bubble. Vinny, you ran away from it. No, that was numbers. You need the flower to get the bubble number. It doesn't work otherwise, no? Vinny, you bounce it? You have to hit it three times. Oh. So I guess I have to redo the level or just like perish if I want that now. Wait, the ghosts can help you? Oh, look, she's a little ghost! Luigi, she's swimming toward the void! Again, it's weird to me that ghosts and sperm alike have the same tail. I find that rather interesting, that at the end of your life and the beginning, you have a little tail and not legs. This is real. This is real.
I get it now, chat. Don't worry. That wasn't the Wowie Zowie. Where is the Wowie Zowie? I mean, the, the Wowie plant. The wonder. You fucked it up. I bet that plant, that flower has some good stuff to say. I want to see. Ooh. I missed that before. Oh, that's what I missed before. Okay. Sorry, I was probably doing a bad bit and not paying full attention. So, chat, this game is pretty fun so far. I didn't expect it to not be fun. But I like the variety in each level. Oh, that's what that is. Someone just said this game is low-key incomprehensible. <gasps> the music! Nintendo, you just, you just won. Inject the nostalgia directly into my veins. Love that sound. Not only was it the music from Mario World, it was the same, like sound font too. Like they just took, uh, they took the exact song. They knew. Chat, they knew. Terrible. This rock fell here because of that awful Bowser. I'd smash it if I could, but it's just so huge. If only had 10 flower coins. They give us poplins and energy boost. Just turn into an elephant. Ghosts? You know, this game is actually ghosts in your living room. Wiggler race. Everybody, it's Wiggler Wednesday. It's, it, it, well, it was a couple days ago. How do you get hired as a flower in a Mario game? I want that I want that job. Go, 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 go. Oh. Oh. It's doing so good.
Oh, cool, you can grab onto those. They knew who I was playing as. They say Daisy regardless of who you are? Oh, come on. Wait, no. No? I guess Daisy is a flower. She should be Flower Kingdom royalty. Auto Super Mushroom Badge to celebrate your victory. It triggers the effects of a Super Mushroom when you start a course. They've even managed to take over the palace here. There's a special treasure kept there that's known as the Royal Seed. We've got something. We've got to do something before they use it for some evil purposes. Here we go! Vinny, go back and check out the path you opened with the rock. Was that not just an entirely new level? Still World One. Wait, so how does this work? You get oh, you get a wall jump that allows you to go directly up first. Before you start jumping to the side. Daisy is so petty. Impressive. Just gonna drop her cardboard Impressive. right in front of Peach like that. Impressive. What time is it in New York? Time to make it a pizza! We got the badge you just used as a gift. Yeah, I like that badge. That one doesn't seem too game-breaking. It might be, but it seems pretty, pretty cool. Probably get me killed a couple times. Just whole-ass levels that me, a grown-ass man, gets to play down here, huh? Start difficulty there. Well, let's see what's over here now, because this is still part of the same world. Um, wow. Expansive first level. Bloat, it's your turn. Did anyone know that Koopas could roller skate? Look at what they do when they hit into each other. They, they give each other like a little booty blast. It's fun. Whoa, 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 whoa. Vinny, why didn't you go to Vegas with Mike? So it's one of our uh, friend's wedding. It's a there's a wedding, and uh, I don't like going to weddings. But he's one of my my 
pretty much one of my best friends. And so that's tomorrow. That, and I don't really like traveling to, you know, that far. I don't really love planes. I'm good with flying, I just don't like airports. So, I've never been to a TwitchCon. And, I have one more reason. Well, A, I wouldn't have even been on the stream. Like, I don't want to be in IRL streams. I really don't. Like, I would have gone out of my way to avoid that. So I just want to let you know, like, if that was the expectation, that's just not me. I'm sorry. Um, but I also... Oh. I also was just at New York Comic Con this past week, and that was a lot of convention. To be, like, a week before TwitchCon. I'm pretty sure last year TwitchCon was the same day as Comic-Con, so, you know, if I do go next year, I'm gonna have to choose. But it would have been nice, I mean, there's a lot of people there I wanted to, like, meet, or a lot of people like Jerma that I wanted to hang out with. Um, but yeah, it just wasn't in the cards. Get it? Cards Vegas? I know. Would you have done any gambling? Um, last time I gambled was at Atlantic City. I spent $100 on blackjack, and I lost it. And that was enough gambling for me. So yeah, maybe $100 worth of blackjack, and then I would have just stopped. Don't love gambling. Debt arc. I need to make that hundred dollars back, everybody. That's why I played that Kong game. Whoa, 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 what was this weird shit? I'm walking on air! I'm a big fan of the blow jump noise. Also, the online is surprisingly cool. It's not distracting. I mean, maybe it's a lot like some extra visual input that some people would rather have off, but it's not really bothering me too much. Oh, this is Yoshi's Island music. Or some remix thereof. Oh. Is it? I don't know. Someone said it is. It sounds a little bit like it. It's similar, but it's not quite. Oh, okay. It does, yeah, it reminded me a little bit of the bonus music. Uh, but yeah, I would, listen, I, it would have been great to go to Vegas with my friends and hang out and see people and meet people. It would have been cool. And there are a lot of other... There are a lot of other reasons why it would have been cool. Like, I would have loved to see Vegas for the first time and that giant obnoxious sphere. But, yeah. get meat on the sphere. I believe that's $55,000 to get meat on the sphere for a day. Pop up, pop -o. And yeah, I haven't been to a wedding in years. Many, many years. I don't like them. I had a couple bad experiences. I know it sounds weird. People don't believe it. But I, I was at the worst wedding ever. Like, 11 years ago. 
It was the worst, most tacky, gross wedding. Person was very, very close to me. I saw them three times since the wedding. And I spent a lot of money, and it was just like... A $100,000 wedding. It was it was really just not a good time. It was out in the middle of fucking nowhere. It, it sucked. It really sucked. So... Please elaborate. That's it. That's the elaboration, really. It was just a bad wedding that I went to, and it really turned me off to weddings. And then I realized not everybody... Oh, secret. Not everybody has a wedding like that. And uh, when it's one of your best friends that you know for sure, you're going to end up still staying friends with after the marriage. Which doesn't always happen. Um, then, yeah, it's, it's, it's something that I feel like it was... I had to do this, and, and it's, you know... Of course, I'm going to show my support for a friend I, I deeply care about. As opposed to just some friend of a friend who's like, Come to, uh, come to Florida for our destination wedding. No, I'm, I'm going to pass. I haven't seen you in three years. Hey, Captain Toad. This is our first time meeting, right? Or maybe I, you already know who I am. How is this motherfucker also in every Mario game? Good for him. It's busy exploring, searching for treasure. Next, th next thing I knew, I got caught in a blizzard. I didn't find much treasure, but the view sure is pretty, huh? During that blizzard, 50 flower coins came flying right at me. Oh, thanks, Captain Toad. I'd go to Captain Toad's wedding. Someone said, will you be wearing your question mark cap? Question mark block cap to the wedding. I go in full Vinny uniform. Take Norts. Who do you think my plus one is? <laughs> go dressed as Leon Kennedy. Parachute cap. I like that these modifiers can be used for challenges. Just gives a lot of variety to the gameplay. Yeah! Where did that hat come from anyway? I don't remember. It was like 13 years ago or 12 years ago. <laughs> it was like 13 or 12 years ago, and it was just on some gamer website. You know, like, uh, not Fan Gamer. There were other websites like that, like the Yee-T. Um, and I saw it advertised, and I bought it, and then I think they stopped selling it, and then they went out of business. Since then, I've explained this. Um, I've, I have now... A couple replacement hats. One in particular, which is a size bigger, because that hat was way too small for my head. And it fucking hurt. I would wear it at conventions, and at the end, I would have a big red mark around my head, and it would fucking hurt. So, I... Um... I have one now that someone made that's really good, really nice looking, and a size bigger, so I can wear it comfortably. And that's a really, really nice thing to have. Vine hat induced brain damage. Well, it explains a lot. Vinny, would you eat toilet? I read that. That's toadette. I read that as toilet. Wait, what? What did you just ask me? Are you sure you didn't wear the hat? Whoa. Underworld uh, theme remix. It's 
wrong with this pipe? Why is it prolapsed? You gotta push? No, don't say that like that, chat. What do you mean you gotta push? It says Mario, but that's clearly Luigi. Vinny, the pipes. What do you want me to do with them? Oh. Well, I want to get back there. Oh, that's really cool. Wow, it's nice to see new ideas in Mario. And not just Kaizo levels in Mario Maker 2. Mario is a plumber. This is his job. I ain't never seen this motherfucker plum before. So, consider me tickled. Luigi was KO'd. I really like this level. <laughs> Every fucking time I hear Wowie Zowie, I swear. Wait, I think I know how to do this. Note that Elephantario moves it even easier. Moves it faster. The slinky dinky. There's pipes. So what? They're alive. They're sentient pipes. What's weird about that? Come on. No. Wonderful. Was it all a dream? It was all in your head, Luigi. Oh my god. Too heavy for the pipes. Thoughts on the new enemy designs that aren't just Goombas and Koopas. It's like, I'm very happy we're getting new enemies. They look good. I like that Goombas and Koopas are in the game. As they should be. Cringe. <laughs> I thought Mario was so big that he could just run into them.
What you gonna go with? Sub 20. Oh, fuck. No, there's more. Man. It's like, um, the original Mario Brothers arcade game. Sub. 42. God damn it. The music uses the leap motif from the original game. Uh, from the original Mario Arcade. Oh, cool. Light motif? Is it light or leet? I think it's light motif. Anyway, I did it, everybody. Uh, I, I did it. Sub 70. I'm sure I could get that time down to like 50. Down to 40. 40. 30. Anyone do it in 30? This, okay, the theme here for the uh, underground music, like the way it sounds, reminds me a hell of a lot of the original Mario Brothers cartoon shows. Like, I'm almost positive they've done this exact thing with this theme for some of those shows where, like, Luigi was like, Oh no, Mario, what are we gonna do? Luigi! We gotta put it in! But Koopa's in there! Koopa's in everywhere! You're just not looking hard enough, Luigi! Believe and you can get in too! Thank you, I've taken improv classes. I haven't. Was it obvious? Oh, I see what people are doing with their signs. So that, like, other people can try to reach them. like what they did with the underground theme. I know it sounds like the Mario Brothers cartoon, like I said, but it's still really nice. I still have no clue you kiss how a sign was positioned to look like you were pulling something out of Peach's ass. Yeah, chat member, did you take the Wonder Flower before joining the stream?
Man, now I want cardboard. Let's go buy some Pokemon cards if I want cardboard. Wonder Flower missed. Oh yeah, I did miss the Wonder Flower. Go down with the flower on the pipe. I thought the chat members were being gross when they told me to go down on the flower. You've heard of the Venus flytrap, yeah? We're doing this joke again? Oh, I see. Sentences are now jokes. Pretty good Charles impression. I did say this in my, uh, my Charles Martinet video, but the fact that Charles left such a mark on this character and this world to me means that this voice for the next 50 years will always be like, Oh, as opposed to, Oh, So yeah, he had, uh, I mean, I almost feel bad for the new guy because he's doing a good job, but there will always be comparisons to, to the Charles Martinet voice because it's so important to so many people and like everyone grew up with that voice. I grew up with Luigi, did you shit yourself? So that's, that's my Mario that I grew up with. But then of course, after Mario 64, I was like, oh, this guy is very bing bing and I like it. But. You know, I'm sure in time he'll put more of his own spin on the character. And then Chris Pratt is just like, uh, hey, uh, it's a me, uh, Mario. And he did fine in the movie. You get used to it real quick, and it's not like... It's not terrible, it's just kind of his own voice. This is, whoa, 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 this level's insanity. Oh, I missed one. Good job. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah. Uh. You need to bring a wowie zowie here, yeah. Why'd you come this way? Ooh.
Look at him. He's even more squat than usual. Wow, he is a stump. Well, what did, I wonder what I missed, because I got both flowers. It couldn't have been... Was it a secret exit, maybe? Is a secret exit. Ah. Uh, I want to bring an elephant. Did I get posing Luigi? Okay. Um, I thought it's a poison Luigi. That's the one. X well crouched. Each time you place a standee, the design will change. Oh, like it depending on the character you're using. Chat, um, this level had the hidden exit, right? Or was it this one? Piranha plant one. How, how do I find it? Go into the menu to travel to any course. <laughs> it's a secret you can't find it. Wow, no one is helping. Yeah. I also need to get a Wowie Zowie for that other level. Alright, do I need the flower or no flower? Alright, I'm gonna look for it here, chat. I'm gonna look for it. It's after the dance number. certainly is a choice to have this be level two of the game. <laughs> Makes an impression. Dance number is now over. Just about. It's not in there.
Whoa, Mario. So close. Really nice run graphics you got there, Mario. Yeah, I enjoy the shit-eating grin. I enjoy the footsteps, too, that are like... More Captain Toad, huh? Quite the surprising place to run into someone, huh? I heard there was a treasure somewhere around this place. Next thing I knew, here I was. Do you think anyone lives on those islands over there? What's with all the smoke? And then I found 50 flower coins. They're all yours. Should be helpful out in the world. See you around! I just need, I need elephant. But I don't want elephant right now. Um, horse selection is convenient. This is the one, right? Uh, Bull Rush Express? Yes. Streamer. What? Then you didn't read the text. You don't keep the elephant unless you finish the level. Okay, I'll get the last. Get, yep, mm -hmm. that's fine. Onward, what a beautiful day. Has that ever been a thing in Mario where you uh, can just go into a level for a second, get the power up, and then leave? I feel like that's been in some of the games. All games. Oh, so this is the outlier. Literally 1984 happening in this game. Also, I believe Koji Kondo composed some of the uh, music for this. Like, he actually wrote some new songs for the game. Kojima Condominium. Yeah. The Here We Go in particular. That's one. Amazing. Uh, that's one where I'm like, oh, this is a new human. Wow. 
there are certain lines where I'm like, oh, that's just Mario. And then there's, like, times where I hear it, I'm like, oh, that's a, that's a different voice actor. As I said before, it is a different voice actor, so it sounds different. And I'm okay with that, but, you know. Just every now and then I'm like, oh, right, that's a thing. your opinion on the new P-Switch music. It's pretty good. Nice job. You came the cool way. The cool way. Did you ever come the cool way, Chad? <laughs> okay. I just repeated what the flower said. I just changed the tense. And if you're feeling tense, you can come the cool way and you won't anymore. I Listen, I understand if you have to leave. Oh, look! Another shadow level, like Donkey Kong Country Returns. This is another one of those things that's been done a bunch, but it's neat every time it happens. It's just shamelessly. It to me, it's just shamelessly. Uh, Donkey Kong Country returns, but I don't even care. I love it. So, I would imagine this game has been influenced by Retro in a lot of ways. I mean, I've, I've often said that Donkey Kong Country uh, Tropical Freeze is one of the best 3D platformers. Like, 3D side-scroller platformers um, ever. So, I mean, if you're gonna borrow, borrow from the best. Three D, two D. Yeah, well, it's three D visually, but it is a side scroller. So I just call them three D side scrollers. I don't, I don't know. The temptation to call them two D Mario games is still quite, quite strong, but um, I don't know how accurate that is. I guess it's understood as such, but. Excuse me. What the fuck? I'm not even going to say it, chat. I've already eaten the low-hanging fruit. There's nothing left on the tree. There's no fruits left on the tree. Why would I even do it? This is insanity. Someone on the team thought of this, and they were real fucking proud of themselves when it got in the game. So what did you contribute to Mario Wonder? Oh, the, uh, the long Mario level in the, in the shadow? You genius. Future director of a Mario game right there. They got a raise, and then they went straight to hell. Before they died. Yeah, it's real... Real unfortunate. Well, did you see that? Mario turned into an actual elephant for a second.
Springs. Cosmic Popos. This is all still World 1. Huh. Vinny, will you buy the new Metal Gear Solid collection? Um, I don't know. Apparently there's some issues with it, but I haven't looked into it too much. Uh, maybe there's frame rate issues or something? Complete waste of money, don't- it's really low effort. Yeah, that- that seems to be the, the sentiment I've heard a couple times. Wait, Konami and low effort? For their most beloved franchise, pretty much, outside of Castlevania? At least the Castlevania collection was good. It's like one positive. It's obviously meant for people who have never played a Metal Gear game. Well, it's a shame that Metal Gear has been relegated to uh, low effort, because uh, there is that Metal Gear Solid 3 remake, which... You know, I kind of just forgot about it. Like, I want it to be good. They're using the original vocal takes, right? The voice lines. So that's, like, kind of nice. But, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I want it to be good. I don't think it will be. That was a good wowie zowie. It was like sassy. Don't think I was supposed to do that like that. Okay, that's forgiving. Five hundredth take of the day of wowie zowie. No, uh, can we get two more Wowie Zowies? And at this point, he's done Wowie Zowie 500 times, and he's just like, Wowie Zowie. Wowie Zowie. Fucking Stanley Kubrick in the, in the recording booth with the, uh, voice direction. No, we just need another 400 takes, if you don't mind. It's funny because Stanley Kubrick is often viewed as this, um, like, I think a lot of people think he's British. And he even looks like a classical composer. And he's just some dude from the Bronx, and he's got, like, a bit of a New York accent. He's got a very, like, um, like, soft-spoken way about him. Just some, some New York guy. Never forgive how he treated Shelley Duvall. Well, I'm maybe not one to speak on this, but you should read Shelley Duvall's book and uh, what she said about Stanley and how much she, she actually did say he was amazing. But I think there's, like most things, probably a couple different aspects. I've often said the same thing, like, man, that fucking sucked what happened. And then I read, like, her first-hand accounts, and 
I get apparently she really respected the process and him as a director. But you know, make up your own mind. As most things in life, not not so easy and simple. Some things kind of come with a little bit of thought and complexity and like, oh, what was that? Good? Bad? Mix? But yeah, I agree. Also, the reason I brought that up is because the dude was famous for doing a lot of takes, and apparently there were times where he did like a hundred takes, so that can't have been fun to work with. That must have sucked as an actor. Anyway, uh, point... You get the point. Um, this is a fucking awesome bonus. You get to go to space. Speaking of, did you ever see 2001 A Space Odyssey? No? Okay. Would you do a hundred takes of you saying something funny? Uh... I can't even get one take of something funny, so yeah, I would probably do a hundred. time, everybody. No, it's not time yet. We still got more levels. I thought we were gonna go defeat the Koopa. It's not happening. Oh, okay. We got a fast badge. Dash continuously at incredible speed. If you run off an edge, you'll have a short window where you can jump in midair. What's that called? Coyote time? Luigi, save me! Luigi, come back! No, not now! Not now! Blood! 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 I need you to save me! Okay, that's a really fun badge. That's- that's not just coyote time, that's go fuck yourself gravity time. It's like, you don't even have to be anywhere near a ledge to jump. So is the game good so far? It's, it's pretty good, yeah. Pretty good. Wait, you pronounce it coyote. Is it coyote? Coyote. I've always heard it pronounced as coyote. Special world. Hmm, those flower cheeks looking quite luscious though. Oh, where are we exactly? This entire area feels really special, doesn't it? It looks like the Star World in Mario World. Difficulty, five stars. Pipe Rock Plateau Special. Oh, this badge is- is too much.
uh, perfect level for this badge. Uh, maybe? See you later. It, it's a little, it's a little See much. It's just too fucking fast. Oh god, no, 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 this badge is- no, 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 no. Way too much. Help. Please, I'm pathetic. I'm a ghost with a little tail. Please help. Probably this one. Swear to God, Peach! I can't be saving all of these freaks. Oh! Did I hear a baby? Oh, that's Yoshi. So this level might be a little difficult. Do, do I just wait now until it rolls on back? I don't know. Oh, there's another one. Okay, hang on. I got this. I don't got this! Luigi, no! Oh, their signs can help you, too. I mean, it doesn't fucking matter. I'm, I'm pretty much... Without the ball, I'm dead. Oh, this is insanity. <laughs> uh, people are using Yoshi for this. What was that about no Kaizo? Yeah. I'm not willing to use Yoshi, but this badge is probably going to end up helping quite a bit. Man, it's fine. I don't want it anyway. Oh, oh, you good? You good? Way to go. Why did you help him? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. between them hippo cheeks, but no. Is this game good? I want to elaborate on that. It is a good game. And there's a lot of personality. Which, uh, some of the new Super Mario Brothers games lacked a little bit of that. And, and the amount of variety in this game is, is really good. All the new mechanics are good. 
Music is good. Everything is good. It's just a good Mario game. It's bad because there is no gun. We don't have enough wonder seeds. There aren't any royal seeds here, but this is a great place to put your skills to the test. Are you up to the challenge of these difficult courses? It's just cool that you can get here a little bit early. Which, again, like I said, reminds me of Mario World. You need to find the secret entrances. Yes, very much like Mario World. So, let's see. It's been almost two hours I've been playing this, and we finally get to a castle. I mean, let's not count the beginning of the stream and some of the glitch, you know, not glitch, the bit, I mean, the, the, the uh, psychedelic, I mean, I like these little fellers. They're Goombas. Oh, they're just cave Goombas wearing skulls. Again, speaking of Mario World, we got the blocks. I love those blocks. Hammer Bros in the classic configuration. Man, if you would have brought this game to me in 1986, or, well, I was one. 1989, when I was playing Mario Brothers 1 for the first time, and you knew that this game, you show me this game in 1989, you could, you would, and the dream of the childhood would be real. Wait, how do I... how do I get that? I wanna wowie. I wanna wowie. Oh, the elephant can actually fucking pulp the dry bones. I'll tell you what, though. When you're an elephant, not a dry bone in the house. Evil Mario theme. I've had a, a dumb smile on my face for a good chunk of this level. And you know what? Even just playing this game. Wonderful. What a year for games. What a fucking year for video games. Aww. 
What, you think you're going to stop me? Huh, okay then, I'll play with you. This palace is super mega loaded with Dad's wonder power. No way you're going to beat me, but it's going to be fun to see you try. Yeah. Get elephant trunk, idiot. Oh, God. Wait, why am I big? Oh, no. I got the mini mushroom now. Pretty easy. But I think I got, yeah, an extra hit in the air like that. Didn't expect to get that extra hit, but okay. It is the first boss, and uh, Bowser Jr. is a little bad baby who's still in diapies, so I'm not expecting the hardest fight. Not until later, at least. And now you weird flowers can do whatever you want in that castle. And so Mario's party reclaimed the palace. With the royal seed safely in hand, they set off to, in pursuit of Bowser, who has somehow turned into a castle. Does... It, do we just get used to emojis being in text? Can they stop Bowser before he pulls off whatever he is planning? They've done that since the Wii. Yeah. Yeah, we kind of just got used to it. It took me a minute, and I was like, Oh, I've seen that a million times. Do you think the flower people fertilize each other? Chat member, you, you were disgusting. I've never said anything disgusting on this stream at all. And here you are bringing down the quality of the stream. Petal Islands are just ahead. This beautiful place is the heart of our flower kingdom. Let's try to catch up with Bowser. No dry bones, huh? No! Yeah, no! no. Anyway, Petal Islands. Water? even get close as long as my cloud piranhas are here which means I can focus on gathering up all the wonder power once I've got enough to pull off a big wonder the world will be mine this is just awful isn't there some way we can stop him oh what's this Where'd that club piranha grow? Go! What have you done? So much power, all from one royal seed. Of course, that's our answer. I have to request that uh, that's almost too much to ask of you. Will you please help me find more royal seeds? They're among our most prized treasures. I believe we can use them to save the Flower Kingdom. The Royal Seeds will get rid of the Cloud Piranhas that are swirling around Bowser. After we get rid of all of them, we'll be able to reach him. Make our way up to the Fluff Puff Peaks north of here. There was a Royal Seed at the palace way up top.
At the center of the Flower Kingdom, there are a chain of islands surrounded by other areas. If you head north from here, you'll reach Fluff Puff Peaks. The kingdom map makes it easy to see where the petal islands connect to other areas. Okay. All the fish have been scared off by that guy. Can't get any fishing done with him around. Oh, this is awful. We have to help. Don't worry, we'll do everything we can to stop Bowser. Once he's beaten, I'll bet the fish will come back. Oh, whoa, 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 don't get too excited. Holy shit. All for you. Oh, it's getting everywhere. Poof. Poof. Dolphin kick one. Swim. Cool, okay. There's a rhythm to this. Wow, a Mario game with good underwater controls. I mean, it's the same unless you use this badge. But I don't think I'll be doing any underwater levels without the badge now. Oh. You can mash the button, why were you timing it like that? I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna wear that for a bit. I'm gonna try that again. One more time, one more time. Oh, because I don't want to hear this noise every single time. That's why. My thumb is slipping off the stick. Why are these flowers trying to prevent me from getting these helpful coins anyway? Don't they want me to save their shitty kingdom? They're testing you. Oh, that, that makes sense. Bye bye. Yeah. And just a little trolling. With a little trolling. Okay. 
I'm gonna do another couple levels, and then I think I'm probably gonna get going, uh, because I've got some things to do. And, uh, yeah. I've been streaming a lot, as you've heard me say plenty. It's just the abundance of games and Halloween has led to increased streaming. But it was worth it. I mean, it's 100% worth it to play Mario Wonder. This has been... This has been a really good game so far. Looking forward to digging into this even further. Also, to answer the question from last night, what what was I eating? What was I going to eat today? I have an answer. This is the dumbest possible thing I could even entertain. Well, there's more dumb things, but I'm going to tell you anyway. I have... <laughs> No, chat, not those things. I had chicken salad on a roll with a little red onion, lettuce and tomato, and fresh mozzarella, which we Italians say mozzarella. Someone said, wow, how boring. It was delicious because there's a good chicken salad that I'm aware of. I know a place that does excellent chicken salad. But yeah, I couldn't just eat a giant glizzy and, and you know, Listen, I'm a glizzy gladiator on most occasions, but it was actually really delicious. If I want to eat a little less gross, that's that's one way to do it, and it still tastes really good. We just blow here forever. Good for you. Yeah, this badge makes underwater a lot better. The only thing less exciting would have been a piece of toast. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> also, chat doesn't realize the bread is excellent. We're not talking about, like, bullshit Subway bread or some, like, Wonder Bread or something. This is from a real bakery. Good bread can make a sandwich triple better. Triple better, chat. I swear. That, and also legit fresh mozzarella from, like, an Italian deli can take a sandwich even further. So, no, I disagree. If you tasted it, you some of you probably would think it was boring, but I think other naysayers would be like, Oh, I understand. Chat wanted me to say I was eating a hot dog on a pretzel roll with cletus. Clamato. I, I also, I fucked that up, didn't I? Why not just eat a PB&J? Well, why not just eat schnitzel for breakfast? Why eat anything other than what you want me to eat, chat member? No, I... I <laughs> This is one of those cases where chicken salad's pretty good, but... Have you had tacos? Uh, I kind of want to get that thing that I missed. Chat, was it the Wonder Bubble, or was I busy talking about chicken salad and I fucked up? It was the Wonder Bubble? Alright. Did I accidentally find a secret? Oh. I guess that could just happen in this game. You did it! Someone said, now I want some carnitas tacos. Listen, I, I am a... I'm a taco fan. I am a taco fan. And now you're making me want tacos for dinner. I'm a taco-holic, chat.
Save me! Peach! Peach, I need you to save me! Peach! 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 Yeah, 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 get me! Get me! Peach! 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 Oh! Don't forget sign save you too. I did forget about that. The game definitely gets easier if you abide by those rules and you play online. It gets a lot easier. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to want to play the game like that forever. Turn off signs. Rule of fun. Is it fun? It's fun. But I also like a little bit of a challenge in my platformers. I don't need Kaizo necessarily, but... You know, it's more rewarding for me if I... Fuck up on a level a couple times and then I end up, like, getting a good run. But I also play Babby Kirby games and love those, so I, I don't really mind if it's not, like, overly difficult. But, uh, I might turn it off. I'm not sure yet. I'm thinking about it. Being able to first try every level isn't always the most fun. Depends on what kind of gamer you are, I guess. But I, tip I typically enjoy the end of Mario games more than the beginning. The beginning is just fun because you're just playing the game and, you know, whatever. But at the end of the Mario game, when you get the optional bonus levels that are, like, nightmare-inducing... I say nightmare-inducing like it's bad, but it's actually good. And here's why. Here's a 20-minute video essay on why it's good. Hmm. Ah, oh, okay. Looks like the invisible blocks are also... That's cool. That's like the frog suit in Mario 3. Um... Oh! We don't have our suits! Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, it's, it's like... Hard uh, game and optional level. Is, is a good time, that's all. I think I said what I had to say. Yeah, it's fine. I don't really have anything to say. You know this. Oh! Just make the funny noises, press the fart button. They're like those little turtles. You know what I'm talking about, chat? What is We Don't Have Our Suits From? It's Crispin Glover in Friday the 13th 4. He just says it in a really, really bizarre way. He's talking about not having their bathing suits when they're at the lake because they want them to go swimming at this lake. And Crispin Glover says that. And then they go skinny dipping anyway. And then they die. Yeah, that's not a spoiler. It's a Friday the 13th movie. That's the only one I've ever seen. They're not good movies. Soft Shell Koopas? They're delicious, Soft Shell Koopa. I say it's not a good movie. Meanwhile, the movie I've watched the most in my life is probably The Room. So, uh... Clearly, I'm fine with that. Yeah. 
But why is Daisy a puffer fish? Wait, wait, wait. You can can you get down there? Is that Is that for a secret? What is that? Oh my god. Bro. Man. Bro. Josh, Josh. Try that again. Sometimes I have to remind myself I'm playing online. Otherwise, like, I start to wonder, like, why is Yoshi just randomly in this level? Wait, what? That pipe got... filled with some magic. Yourself, flower. Did that flower just get killed? Careful out there. Just disappeared. That'll be enough, uh, wandering for today. Chad, it's great. I mean, it's- it's Mario. It doesn't play tremendously different. I mean, I'm sure there's a, a two-hour video essay about how different the gameplay is from, you know, new Super Mario Brothers to this, but... It feels like a Mario game. A little less floaty, maybe, than the new Super Mario Brothers games. But, overall, really, really good game. Lots of unexpected moments. And, uh... Yeah, I'm definitely enjoying it. We'll see where it goes. 
but I have a feeling I have to defeat the bosses to defeat Bowser. I have a feeling about that. I'm really invested in the story, chat. Also, the grass texture is is uh, really weird. It's it, I don't think I don't see that, Nintendo. I see what you're doing to make that grass look like it's blowing in the breeze. Yeah. All right, chat. Thanks for joining me early today. Uh, I hope you enjoy Mario Wonder if you pick it up. And if you don't, well... There's always other babby games. Like Maxwell the Cat. Who's been almost pushed off of my screen finally. Alright, well have a good one. Uh, thank you again. And I'll be around on Sunday. For my Sunday stream. And next week we'll be doing uh, World of Horror. More Dead Space. And I'm probably going to just focus on. You know, October Halloween stuff. For next week. Mostly. But we'll do more of this as well. And more uh, Cyberpunk maybe early November. I want to finish Phantom Liberty, but probably not until I finish my other stuff. So, yeah. So that's what I'm playing at the moment. I uh, hope you all have a great day. And I, you know, I'll see you around. Good night. Oh, wait. It's not night. Goodbye. <laughs>